Hi there, folks. This is Sean Barton from Florida PDAC, and I'm speaking to Ramon Perez. He's the CEO of Candelaria Mining. They have a great project, Caballo Blanco, that I've actually been to down in the province of Veracruz, Mexico. Um, it uh, was a great project back then. It didn't work out. Now these guys have it, picked it up for a song, and they're going to try and do something with it. Could you tell my viewers what you guys are up to down there? Absolutely. We're, we're looking to develop the Caballo Blanco project in the state of Veracruz, Mexico. We have about a million ounce resource, uh, open pit on each project, and we're currently going through permitting. Um, we should have the application for the permitting will be submitted beginning of April, and we're looking for August, September approval from the federal government of Mexico. Okay, great. What are the milestones that we should look for from your company, say, over the course of the next year? Um, we, we're raising about $12 million in capital uh, mm -hmm. over the next month, and with that, we'll be doing some infill drilling to, to take us to a feasibility study. Um, we'll also, we're also looking to, well, the permits, obviously, August, September, that'll be a pretty big milestone, and the results from our exploration program. Okay, great. Now, I can tell you folks, especially working in Mexico, some other parts of like Latin America, local support is so important. And at one time, this particular province was not that friendly. That's the last time I was down there. But the government has changed. That's really helping you out, isn't it? Absolutely. So the opposing governor, uh, the project was previously, uh, previously, previously held by Google and the governor, Javier Duarte, opposed the project. He no longer is the governor of the state of Veracruz. There's a completely new party and government that's come into Veracruz, and and they they have shown that they're in favor of developing mining in the, in the region, and we're looking for a success on the permitting from August. Oh, great. Now, about this project, it has some nice, rich targets all around it, and all pretty much look the same. They just have to put drills down in there to see that, that that it is what it looks like. So it's an easy project from that angle. They're going to do 40,000 meters of drilling, and we'll get the results from that, I guess, over the course of the year. Over the course of 12 months, exactly. Right. So there, there's about six or seven other targets, aside from La Paila, where the current resource sits, of a million ounces. Uh, these other seven targets have very similar characteristics to that of the La Paila zone. And, and we look to, to explore those and, and hopefully expand the resource throughout the Bible. Well, it'll be an exciting story. Can't see, can't wait to see what happens because this one has been on my radar for a long, long time. Thanks very much for speaking to my Thank viewers. You, um, you, you guys stay tuned. Is there anything else you want to say or have we no, wrapped it up? Pretty, pretty All right. You folks stay tuned. There'll be more from the PDAC.